Hey, we're all clear right now across uh, the Metroplex. There's the rain to the east. It's real light stuff in Canton down to Athens, Corsicana. A couple little thunderstorms just rolled through Mejia. That's about it. But it's out to the west. This is our next batch. We've had severe thunderstorms, had a couple tornado warnings around Midland. Uh, but this next batch of precip, that's where it is right now. 10, uh, 10, 19, 10, almost 10, 20, 58, 59, 10, 20 right now. So there we are. That's where it is. That's where it'll be at midnight. Now watch this. Overnight tonight, we're fine most of the overnight. By 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning, we'll have a little bit. Of, none of this is severe. A little bit of rain around, a couple rumbles of thunder. That's 6 in the morning. There's 7 in the morning. You see, then about 8, 9 o'clock, it's, it's gone tomorrow. And then we're dry most, some clouds in the morning. Then we break out into sun tomorrow afternoon. And then late tomorrow night, this is 10 o'clock tomorrow night, here comes another little cluster of showers and storms. So it's not widespread coverage or anything like that. And I don't have any severe weather in my forecast. That's midnight Saturday night. Look at that. Then it's all gone by Sunday. And Sunday we, we have sunshine and har, uh, much, much warmer temperatures in our forecast. So about 20% late, late tonight, 20, 30% of a sea rain over overnight tonight and tomorrow morning. Then it's late Saturday night, early Sunday morning, the same thing. But we hit 87 tomorrow and then 93 as we head through the day on Sunday. Let me uh, show you the tropics real fast. Here's a system. It's not yet a named storm. It will be. I thought it might be by uh, this time tonight, but it hasn't been. It most likely will be early, early tomorrow morning. If it does uh, uh, become a named storm, it has to have winds of 39 miles an hour or stronger to become a tropical storm, and that's when you get named. Uh, it'll become Alex. There it is. It's just off the coast of Fort Myers, 185 miles off the coast of southwest Florida. There it is. It's landfall is tomorrow morning, 7 o'clock. Remember, 39 to 73 miles per hour, that's a tropical storm. 74 or stronger, that's a hurricane. It's at 40, so it's a minimal system. So it's not going to pack a whole lot of winds as it moves across the peninsula during the day tomorrow. It's, it's offshore. It's off the east coast of Florida by Saturday evening, but it's going to dump. It has been dumping. You think Tarrant County had a lot of rain tonight. We're looking at six to 10 inches of rain from Fort Pierce to Fort Myers and location south. So the southern part of the state, it will be inundated with heavy, heavy rain. Six to 10, that's a lot of rain. 68, that's the low tonight. During the day tomorrow, we hit 87 for the high. Uh, remember, late, late tonight, early tomorrow morning, we have a chance of some thunderstorms. And then late tomorrow night, early Sunday morning, we have another chance. And then once the uh, faucet shuts off, there it is. Nope, it's not our old friend the wind, although you may want some wind next week. It is going to be a hot one. Highs in the upper 90s. The heat returns to North Texas and a little bit of rain the end of next week.